Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time we killed a bunch of stuff in that pit. And we met with our good friend Sindri, who uh, just before we started recording reminded me that the whetstone is a precious uh, artifact and I should take great care when handling it. Again. Oh, that was totally what I needed to do there, and you could see the thing from here. Oh, this one's just full of refried beans. Good thing the can is very poorly made. Hey, maybe this is a bad idea. Oh my. Yeah, I know it's been a while now, but, uh... I just want to say, uh... Now that the Christmas holidays are over, that I hope all of you guys had a lovely holiday. I read every single comment wishing me a Merry Christmas or a Happy Boxing Day, and I am very thankful for all of them. I had a very nice Christmas with my family, and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed yours too. I was touched at all those messages. Chisel. Huh. But this very much looks like a fighting arena. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Surrender. The old father demands it. No. <sighs> Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go. And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother. The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? Both of them? <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. Remember the last time we faced a sexual challenge. Oh, there's a challenge. An old man. Still born lad. <laughs> you oh, take the lid. Oh, right. <laughs> Unbelievable. You need to oppose the might of Asgard. You've got some father cue. You really are a dumbass, aren't you? Hey, remember this one? <laughs> okay. I need that back now. Thank you. I'll take the rope. Oh, that was a bait. God damn. I need help. I can't 
Stay behind me, boy. Why do you hunt us? What does Odin want? Don't know. Don't care. Come here, Harry. You don't know who that is. Shut up! Don't call me that! Yeah! Yeah! Out you go. Can't believe you've lied this long. No skinny little arms can barely lift the fun. I said, shut up! Calm yourself, boy. Looks like they need another lesson. Oh, I'm more than happy to teach you. Now I could use that. Sure, sure. I guess she wouldn't have, huh? Very difficult, after all, to get life advice from a dog. I'd heard that about Thor, you know. He was into all kinds of crazy shit. Stopped recording again. That's not a great time for it, but it doesn't seem to be doing the same thing as last time. Also, I totally forgot about that. Uh, which was the one? It was already instru in done in something else. Oh, more luck. 
Okay. That's better, and... Mm, nothing with lightning. I mean, sure, cooldown is bad for me. What's this over here? He's sick. He needs Freya. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? We should keep an eye on him. Magni, the older son of Thor. He had a huge sword, could use the power of lightning, and was really mean. Father killed him. Modi, the younger son of Thor and a relentless creep. He can also shoot lightning and uses a mace and shield. He ran off after Father killed his brother Magni, but I bet we haven't seen the last of him. I'll kill him next time I see him. Giant chisel. And as for you, tell Hella to tell the others that the age of fucking around has ended and that the time for finding out has come. Leap tier alloy. Lightning-infused metal used by the kin of Thor, used to upgrade pommels with shock damage effects. Found in treasure map caches. <sighs> Frozen flame! That's what that looks like. An impossible material that houses the rage of fire and the temper of ice. Ge generated through mighty battles. Used to upgrade the Leviathan Axe. Yeah, I didn't get that when I got that from a troll, but the idea is that they only drop from specific boss battles in the storyline. I guess this battle was mighty enough to uh, just spontaneously create one. Don't mind that. Leviathan awakens. Oh yes. Good 
Gesundheit. Oh, I'm full. The fear in Modi's eyes. Okay, how's this gonna work? We can't even see the tip, it's in the ground, so I guess we just break off a piece of the hot part? With that, we can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. Oh, jeez. I don't think it actually occurred to Modi until Magni died that they could possibly lose this fight. Find the binding point with the left stick, then press right uh, trigger to strike. He did. He was a god. But you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps. But I. And his father is Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> Since before you were a gleam in his eye, kid. <laughs> Poseidon, Zeus, Hera, Hades. There was Athena, but that was an, that one was admittedly an accident. She uh, stepped in the way when he tried to run Zeus through at the end of God of War Two. Made the entire sequel possible. I guess I can do that. All right. even tell what part of his armor or whatever we're looking at. Once you retrieve the whetstone, please take utmost care while handling it. It is a priceless relic after all. And I switched it back over before I did that. Huh. the button. I must have been in the middle of another animation that wouldn't allow it. Maybe I was on the wall. Oh, I think I was on the wall. Or no, no, I did that before. I don't know. Whatever. Maybe the button input just didn't take us all. Gods were kind of known for their uh, vengeance. But where are the others? Where are the stones? For 
sure it'd be someplace we could only see from up here. Aha! Uh. Where's the last one? Sucks to be you, buddy. Is this not it? Damn. Aha! Lot of hack silver. I wonder if they cut this guy's legs off or if he's just buried up to his waist in snow from sitting here for so long. Glacial Catalyst, a shard from one of Hell's glaciers. It can be used to upgrade the charm of Infinite Storm. I don't have that. I remember that. I found one of those earlier. Or, no, wait. Oh, yes, up there and then down. Right, 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 I remember now. Is the timer? Yes, all right. Let's get out of here, then. Call it an episode. Call it a session. I find it interesting that, unlike a lot of cultures, the Norse clearly didn't think of vengeance as a bad thing. Like, you know, the Greeks had Nemesis, goddess of revenge, but, uh... You know, praying to her was so considered something you only did if you were, well, so desperate that you would, you know, do something evil, I think. I might be completely out to lunch with that. Wait, we were here before. But which way back? Hey, Sindri, have you met Mimir? Uh, if you mean the severed head that keeps blinking at me, please keep it away. There is no possible way that's hygienic. Oh, that's nice. Lovely to see you too, Sindri. Nob. Well, they know each other, do they? Oh, no, I guess he heard the name. Why? Is that a piece of my braided mistletoe arrow adorning your quiver strap? Oh, a little memento of your good pal, Sindri. I'm so terribly touched. I mean, I've been thinking about that. I mean, that's why I wasn't freaking out when Freya destroyed all of the mistletoe arrows. That has to be important somehow. But I mean... You know, it's not like it's poisonous to him. It's just that mistletoe can hurt him. So I don't know how the fuck we're supposed to kill him with just that little piece. I don't know, maybe he's like, gonna grab the kid, cut his hand on it, realize that he can be hurt, and run the fuck away in terror. I could see that. Hey! Did you hear? Magni, the Aesir god, son of Thor, dead! I know! Now Modi's on a rampage across Midgard, looking for the killer, swearing that once he finds him, he'll... Oh shit, that was you guys. We should probably discuss that more quietly. Or not at all. I think that's a great plan. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, shit, that was you guys. Just in the middle of a sentence, I like that. Your Majesty. I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <coughs> Nothing to worry about. If so, then keep up. Yes, sir. 
Incredibly, I don't think Kratos entirely believed that. I was kind of hoping we'd get it, you know, done up more fine than this. That was not the right button. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Huh. Was he supposed to come back? I mean, I don't know how this works. Whoa, why are you in the floor so deep? Press X to pick up the boy and remove him from the ground. Wait, did that door close again? Because if it closed again, yeah, it's not going to work. Okay. Well, I suppose it's just as well. Uh... Oh, that's the thing I kicked out earlier. I just realized that. Gazoon type. But yes, I'm going to call it right here. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you in the next episode of Let's Play God of War. When, uh, well, we head back out into the world, I guess, and, uh, I start backtracking towards the, uh, the original house we lived in, so I can get that first mirror we encountered before any of the other numbered ones. <laughs> you know, I have been meaning to say for a while, so I'll just say it now, that, uh, Although I can't use him to stun my enemies or anything, it has occurred to me that, uh, Mimir means... Uh, Mimir being there means that, as different as it is in the classic games, this game does continue the God of War tradition of Kratos having a severed head in his inventory. <laughs> it's, uh, all three games in the classic trilogy and this one so far that I'm aware of. God of War 1, it was the head of Medusa. You could turn your enemies to stone. Uh, God of War 2, it was the same item, basically, but it was the head of Medusa's sister, Uriali. And uh, God of War 3, it was the severed head of Helios, which essentially allowed you to flashbang your enemies. Yeah, god of the sun and light. Or no, he was the god of the sun. Apollo was the god of light. They were very granular in the Greek pantheon. They were very specific about what they were on about. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys next time when we uh, get looking around to put this chisel to good use, hopefully. I suppose that will come back to haunt us, because the uh, achievement we got for beating that fight was called Troubling Consequences, Defeat Magni and Modi. But we will just have to see. Not much I could have done about it anyway. Okay, just wanted to add the thought that I have realized I forgot to use the frozen flame, and I'm going to write down a note about that. So that's what we're going to do first thing next time. <laughs> Let's go back to Sindri, get him to do some good work. Okay, later for reals, Burning Dog fans. <laughs>